Let's get right to it. This is not a career for the indolent. I have a close friend that's a retired Navy SEAL, and he loves to say, the only easy day was yesterday. Now, what does that mean? Yesterday was easy because it's over and it's done. Today's going to be hard, and so is tomorrow. Right now, the top role in all of AI, and IT for that matter, is the machine learning engineer. It's a top-tier role. There is no easy path to a career as a machine learning engineer. Companies aren't handing out quarter-million-dollar salaries for easy. Think about it. Why would a company pay you that kind of coin for something you could learn in a year? Psst, they're not going to. Learning the hard way means you're going to need to get your hands dirty. Programming is a hands-on sport. You need to do it in order to be good at it. It's like riding a bike. You can read all the books in the world on how to ride a bike, but you won't learn how to ride that bike well until you get on that bike and do it. If you aren't willing to put in the hard work, this career isn't for you. Here are a few suggestions on learning the hard way. Courses are not movies. If you sit and watch a course, you're going to learn nothing. My course on data cleansing came from several books, well over 300 pages in length. How long would it take you to read and study that book? That's the same amount of effort you should be putting into each course. For each course, I'd highly recommend two hours of dedicated study a day for a month, and that includes weekends. Take notes and then go back over those notes. I have students sign up to my platform and take my SQL Server course in a few days. I'll then ask them, what's a data type? What's DDL? What's DML? What's a primary key? What are the core four statements within DML? They respond with, I don't know. If you can't get past the most basic questions working with SQL, you have no chance getting past a technical interview. Technical interviews are hard and they're stressful. If you don't know the material, you're not going to make it. On most technical phone screens, you'll get 20 to 30 questions. These will often be softball questions. A softball question is the easiest question you're going to get. If you miss these, it's on to the next candidate. Technical interviews have no patience for people who can't answer the easiest questions. If you want to work in any IT role, the only way forward is the hard way. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day.